Welcome to EPG Parchala. This is Dr. Ankush Ambardar from Department of Tourism and Hotel Management, Kurukshetra University, Kurukshetra. Today, I'll be taking up a topic from the subject tourism and hospitality, front office operations and management, and the topic is concierge. Well, after completing this module, students will be able to understand the concept of concierge, hierarchy of concierge, equipments used at concierge, functions of concierge, forms and records prepared by concierge section in front office department. Well, the concierge is an integral part of high-end full-service hotels, whereas mid-level hotels are outsourcing concierge services. It is a section of the front office department or part of uniform department of a hotel which helps guests at the time of arrival during their stay in hotel and at the time of departure of guests by providing various services such as luggage handling, mail and messages, fetching errands from outside from the guest, etc. Though hotels use bell desk and concierge interchangeable, but the basic aim remains same, that is providing services to the guests and maximizing profits. Well, talking about concept of concierge, the word concierge has a history of its own. Few argued that the term has its origin in the French word commette de charge, meaning keeper of the candles. These are the persons who help nobles in medieval France. Others opine that the word means doorkeeper porter. The word also refers to hospitality. In India, it is used in more broad sense and refers to a person who has a desk called the desk of concierge. A concierge was not an employee of the hotel until 1936, but an independent entrepreneur who purchased a position from the hotel and paid the salaries, if any, of his or her uniform subordinates. It is used for increasing marketable value and image of a hotel. They are responsible for offering special and customized services to give it an edge over its competitors. For maximizing guest satisfaction, people at the concierge have to anticipate guest needs and fulfill these within the given constraints of guests, that is, budget, time, etc., using contacts of the hotel. For this, they should be very alert and proactive in approach. Their role becomes very important, especially in top-class luxury hotels, where wealthy and knowledgeable guests look for memorable experiences without concerning much about the money. For these kind of hotels, concierge is just like an amenity of utmost importance. However, there will be variations in the duties and responsibilities of concierge depending upon the objectives of properties. For example, concierge may be asked to assist in butler operations, restaurant reservations, transportations, etc. People at concierge should have good awareness of various hotel facilities and services along with the surroundings, that is city, and some details of international events. For that reason, it is an added advantage for concierges that they can communicate in different languages with a friendly personality. Union Professionale de Porus de Grand Hotels also draw the name Clefs d'Or from its emblem, which highlights crossed gold keys, is an international organization which establishes code of conduct and trade for people at concierges. Well, when talking about hierarchy of concierge, it is located exactly near the lobby entrance of the hotel as it is the first department to come in contact with the guest on their arrival. The concierge desk is located near the main entrance of hotel, usually on the left side of the lobby. The location is such that the employees can easily see all the activities of lobby and still remain near to main entrance. Maintaining lobby is also a very important function of the desk. So this has to be the lobby of the hotel. The concierge section is under the lobby manager who is supervised by a room division manager. This section is headed by chief concierge, assisted by senior bell captain, followed by bell captain who is assisted by bell boys and trainees. While talking about duties and responsibilities of concierge section, are more demanding and interpersonal in nature, so the employees working here should have following qualities. They should be talented enough to provide details of facilities and services of hotels, should have better communication, should be good guest handlers, with environment capable in handling pressure, good relationship management skills, maintaining guest history and profiles, able to work for long hours. Well, equipments used at concierge, as discussed earlier, it is an integral part of an hotel lobby because all their functions are coordinated from lobby. For planning the position of the desk, following points should be considered. The desk should be near to the main door. It should be near to the luggage room. 
It should be near to the front desk but not very near as it may disturb their functioning. It should be easily distinguishable from other desks of the lobby. The location of the desk should be such that it is with the eye contact range with different sections of the lobby, example front desk, lobby manager's desk, main gate security, etc. It will help the desk and other related departments in accomplishing their tasks efficiently. Being one of the most important sections of front office, functioning of this department ensure guest satisfaction. As we know that first impression is the last impression to create this. The first impression the desk employees are helped by number of equipments and these can be divided into two following categories. Automatic machines such as computers, semi-automatic example Franklin machines and manual such as luggage trolleys. The equipments at Bell Desk are as follows. Number one desk. This is equipment which has given the name to the session. It is a wooden counter with shelves towards the employee side which are used for storing all the forms, formats, registers and other paper materials required. Luggage trolley. As the name suggests, this is the trolley which is used for carrying luggage. It has a steel metal frame with wheels. The bellboy may pull or push the trolley as per their convenience. It should be kept in the luggage room and checked daily for any maintenance. Franklin machines. This machine is used for stamping postage on the guest letters. It has a preset value which is issued by post office for the deposited amount of money. Weighing scale. This is used for weighing guest letters and parcels. Paging board. This board is used for paging for guests. It is a board to which handle and bells are fixed. Guest name is written on the board and the bellboy holds it above head by handle and shakes it so that the bell rings and it attracts guest attention. Storage racks. These are in the luggage room. These are used for luggage in an order. Wheelchair. This is in the case of any guest with disability. The bellboy will help that guest to his room. Luggage net. This is used for covering the guest luggage so that it doesn't mix up with other luggages. Computers and printers. Nowadays, these are common. This is to make the work easy and quick. The computer terminal is connected with other computers so as to provide information to the bell desk about the guests and their details. First aid box. As the name suggests, the box contains basic material that is used for providing first aid, example, bandage, disinfectant liquid, ointment, plasters, etc. Other equipment such as stamp folders, umbrellas, function board, etc. can be part of bell desk depending upon the policies of the hotel. The number and type of equipments will vary from hotel to hotel depending on the requirements of the property and types of guests. But the aim remains same that is ensuring maximum guest satisfaction and profit to the hotels. Well, when it comes to functions of concierge, number one, greeting and receiving the guest. As we know that this is the first department which comes in the guest contact at their arrival in the hotel, it is the duty of this section to greet and receive the guests on their arrival. They are the one who has to create the first impression. Guest luggage handling at the time of check-in. The bell desk employee helps in unloading the guest luggage from the vehicles and escort the guests to the lobby for registration and finally transports the luggage to the guest room. Introducing hotel facilities to the guest. The bell desk employee while escorting the guest to his room will explain various hotel facilities to the guest, example, various food and beverage outlets, shopping arcades, gymnasium, etc. He will in brief explain the useful information, example, timing, facilities, etc. Explaining various room amenities to the guests. After reaching at the room, the employees will explain various in-room amenities to the guests. This will include air conditioning, switches, televisions, phone numbers, etc. Explaining fire exit plan to guests. This is one of the important functions of the employee. Each room has a fire exit plan pasted on the back of its main door. The bellboys or the didn't explain the fire exit plan to the guests. Delivering mails and messages. Delivering the mails and messages is also the duty of bell desk. They receive these from information desk and deliver these to the guests. These have stamp, date and time to avoid any complaint from guests. Fetching errands from outside for guests. If the guest asks for something that is not available in the hotel, it is the duty of desk to arrange for it. The desk employee will get it from outside. These may include medicines, tickets, etc. Arranges various services from outside. 
As we have stated in the starting of the chapter that sometimes guests may ask for services that are not provided by the hotel, it is the duty of this desk to arrange for these services, example, a reserving table in nearby restaurant, etc. Selling of postal items to the guest. This desk acts as a mini post office for the guests of the hotel and provides them with the various types of postal services such as selling postal stamps, postcards, etc. to the guests on their requests. The bell desk also arranges for various couriers for the guests. Arranges for paging services for the guest. The bell desk also arranges for paging services for the guests in order to locate them in the hotel in case of any message and mails to be delivered to them. The paging activity is performed by the bellboy with the help of a paging board. Delivery of newspaper and magazines to the guest rooms. The bell desk also provides various newspapers and magazines in the guest rooms early in the morning and to the guests asking for these. Carrying out light housekeeping activity in the lobby area. The bellboys also assist the housekeeping staff in carrying out light housekeeping services in the lobby and the reception area. These services include light dusting of front desk, bell desk, furniture of the lobby area and wiping the door of the entrance of the hotel. Keep an eye on scanty baggage guests. They help lobby manager in keeping an eye on the scanty baggage guest. For this purpose, they maintain scanty baggage register, which is duly signed by the lobby manager at the time of arrival of a scanty baggage guest. And it is informed to the front desk so that they can take appropriate measures to safeguard hotel revenue. Helps in maintaining security in lobby. They help security department in ensuring the security of guests and their belongings and also hotel assets and hotel employees. They act in close coordination with security department to avert any mishap. It helps in fighting the emergency situation. In case of any emergency, example natural or man-made, they play a very important role in ensuring the safety and security of all. Physically check the room discrepancy. The employee is responsible for physically checking any room discrepancy that arises due to the difference between the front office occupancy report and housekeeping occupancy report and inform the discrepancies to the front office. Handling guest luggage at the time of checkout. The Beldes employees perform the important functions of transporting the luggage of the guest at the time of department from guest room to the lobby. Then the bellboy finally loads the uh, luggage of the guest in the vehicle and wishes him a happy journey. Submitting C form. It is the duty of this desk to collect and deposit all the C forms to the nearest police stations. This is one of the most important legal obligation which the hotel has to perform in case of foreign guests. Wake up calls. In some hotels, it is the duty of bellless employees to give manual wake up calls to the guests. Handling lift luggage. Bell Desk is responsible for handling lift luggage in hotels. They are responsible for completing all the formalities regarding lift luggage, that is filling all forms, registers, storing the luggage and handing it over to the guest when he asks for that. Providing special facilities to the disabled guests. This desk is responsible for providing special facilities to the handicapped or disabled guests, that is, they provide wheelchair to the guests, handling VIPs, VIPs, as the name suggests, are very important persons so that they must be handled carefully. This helps in creating good image of the hotel and increase guest satisfaction. And being the front and first department of the hotel, front office has to pay special attention towards handling VIPs. Generally, the VVIP guests include well-known personalities from any field of life, example state guests, dignitaries, commercially important persons, entertainment, sports and academics etc. They are huge source of publicity and revenue. So their check-in should be smooth and speedy. The pre-registration activities are very helpful in this. VIP guests will be highlighted in the expected arrival list prepared at front office. It helps in pre-allotment and blocking of rooms as per the requirement of the person. The VIP rooms are communicated to all concerned departments, example housekeeping, FNB services, etc. Amenity vouchers are prepared and sent to housekeeping and room service department in order to make flower arrangements and place fruit and cookies baskets in the guest rooms before the arrival of the guest. The VIP guests are received and escorted directly to the allotted rooms 
where they have to sign the pre-filled registration card. Well, forms and records prepared by concierge desk. Well, proper functioning of any concierge important for the success of an hotel. For this purpose, there are various forms and formats that are used. The main aim of these records is to maintain daily activities of Bellis employees to help management its function, example, controlling, planning, etc. to enhance guest satisfaction. The forms and formats used are Bellis logbook, left luggage register, left luggage tag, skinty baggage register, lobby control sheet. When it comes to bell desk logbook, the bell persons maintain the bell desk logbook to keep a record of all the activities that are performed by them during a particular shift. This book helps in controlling the activities of bell desk employees. It acts as a mode of written communication between two consecutive shifts of the bell desk. The logbook is used for leaving an important instruction and important piece of information for the employees of the next shift. Left luggage register. The left luggage register is used for keeping a record of entire left luggage kept with bell desk. The term left luggage here refers to the piece of luggage items which are left at the hotel by a checking out guest only to be reclaimed at some later date and time as desired by the guest. This service is very useful for guests who have late evening flights. The guests can check out and deposit their luggage with the bell desk. By doing this, guests can save half day room rent and simultaneously, they don't have to carry the luggage with them while visiting various places. Skinty baggage register. The skinty baggage register is maintained by the bell persons to keep a record of all the skinty baggage guests who carry very few luggage, example, a suitcase or just a handbag. Their record is kept because they can check out any time from the hotel without settling the bill. This register is prepared by the bellless employees and signed by lobby manager who may ask the guest to make advance payment. The front office sends a list of all scanty baggage guests and circulates the copies of the list to the various departments such as housekeeping and room service. Lobby control sheet. The lobby control sheet is a summary of all total activities of bell persons during a particular shift. Well, handling luggage at the time of check-in and check-out of the guests. In hotels, at the time of check-in, the bellless has to play a vital role handling luggage of the guest. In case of an FIT guest or a walk-in guest who are individual in nature, they carry less luggage and the luggage can be handled very easily by the bellless people. But in case of group check-ins, where the check-in is for more than 30 to 40 rooms at a time, the number of luggage or the baggage increases incredibly. So the total luggage which we might handle at a time would be 30, 40 or 80 in number. So to handle the, that, those luggage and to take it to the guest rooms, rooming list is prepared by the front office people and which is handed over to the bellless people. One copy of rooming list is even provided to the group guide who accompanies the group which is coming into the hotel. The rooming list details all the rooms which have been dedicated to that particular group. Let us take an example. If there is a check-in of a group with 10 rooms, then those 10 rooms and their keys will be prepared by the reception counter and the rooming list will be provided to the bell desk people. As soon as the people arrive at the check-in time, the luggage is kept at the desk and luggage tags are attached to each and every luggage. And furthermore, the rooming list entails us the room numbers dedicated to those individual guests. When these room numbers are allotted on luggage tags, then it becomes easy for bell list people to carry forward this luggage from the lobby area to dedicated rooms of guests. Even at the time of checkout of a group, they are already told to keep their luggage ready in their rooms or outside their rooms at the time of checkout. The, it becomes easy for a bellboy to carry luggage from these consecutive floors or adjoining floors and to take down that luggage from floors to the guest rooms. 
Well, the importance of bell disc or the concierge disc is very important in present state. They not only look after luggage, but even take care of first aid, any vandalism act which takes place, and so on and so forth. Well, the concierge desk is also a provider of information, not only of city, but even of hotel. The concierge people need to be aware of all the facilities which are provided in the hotel so that during the stay or any at any stage of guest in the hotel, he or she is able to detail all the services and facilities provided by hotels at various point of sales. The guest at any point of time can ask for any detailed information related to cinema tickets, related to tourist places, recreationals, uh, booking further reservations in various hotels, booking restaurant tables, so on and so forth. The concert desk has to keep a record or a track of all such information with them and this is done nowadays with the help of softwares which are present at the concierge desk. Well, the concierge is headed by the concierge assistant manager and is followed by assistant manager concierge and GSE, that is the guest service executives who help in providing such information at all the three shifts during the hotel duration. The left luggage room besides the bell desk contains left luggage of the guest left at the time of checkout and it even has a stock of loan items which are provided to guests whenever they demand. The loan items which are provided at bell desk are first aid box, umbrellas, knives, tracking sticks, so on and so forth. In case of any such loan item which is demanded by the guest, it is provided to them. For example, in case of a handicapped person, a wheelchair which is even stocked at the left luggage room is provided by the bellless people to them. Further, a guest who wishes to track down to a nearby mountain or hill, he is accompanied by a bell desk if in case he requires such assistance. And for that, any equipment which is required is provided to such a guest. Further, these loan items are not chargeable from the guest and are given as a loan complementary to the guest as an additional personalized service of the guests. Well, to summarize the unit, it can be summarized that though the duties and responsibilities of people at concierge are defined, but they may have to generate out-the-box solution for fulfilling guest demands. Their prime jobs are fetching reservations at busiest restaurants, arranging tickets of a sold-out concert, information regarding place and surroundings, or even some unusual requests by the guests. A true concierge makes the impossible possible. For that reason, it is a very important part of a high-end hotel around the globe. Thank you for watching EPG Partshella.